Hi, this is Richard Cogent Paint Techniques. Knockdown plaster is a finish used on the walls and ceilings of many houses built in the last decade or so. It's become popular with home builders because it hides imperfections, is quick to apply, and doesn't cost very much. But it's also a notoriously difficult surface to paint, which is why most builders just spray everything white and leave it at that. The worst problem with it is the junction between the ceiling and the wall. Because it is a highly textured surface, there are no straight edges to cut in the wall paint to. Freehand painting results in ragged lines of paint that either don't make the ceiling line or get overpainted up onto the ceiling. Taping one or the other of the surfaces doesn't work either because the surfaces are not flat and paint will run up under the gaps. Either way, the results are always less than satisfactory. Fortunately, I developed a proprietary method of preparing knockdown plaster surfaces that produces relatively straight lines. I say relatively because you will never get knockdown plaster to produce laser straight lines, but it will be close and the difference will be dramatic. It also works well with popcorn ceiling surfaces, even those where the popcorn ceiling has encroached onto the wall surfaces. My method takes a little more time and effort, which is why most other painters wouldn't even consider it. But if you are looking for straight lines at your ceiling to wall junctions, there is really no other way. It becomes especially noticeable with darker colors, where the contrast between the white ceiling and the dark wall color will make any mistake stick out like a sore thumb. So if you have knocked down plaster and thought you could never have straight lines on your paint job, feel free to give me a call for more information.